Hello everybody. Come on. Let's go for a hike. And down the stairs I go. So it's 6.24 p.m. So of course before I start my walk I go through my favorite uh, location here which is on this bridge. It is my definitely my favorite location in the whole entire camp. I mean I love every spot in this camp but it's definitely my favorite location. One of my favorite locations. This is really cool because this hike that I'm taking at camp involves downhill, uphill, so I'm going uphill. You see? Now we don't have any campers today. They'll be checking in tomorrow. So I'm taking advantage on making this hike my own because I definitely needed to just sort out a few things. Now there's nothing wrong for uh, with me whatsoever or there's nothing wrong for you to get out from wherever you are at and taking a nice solo walk just to get things out of your head or, or maybe you're sad or I don't know maybe you're just confused or lonely or whatever the case may be. It's always a good idea just to go outside and just take a nice walk and focus on the actual present moment and day which I'm doing right now and just focus on that rather than focusing on stuff that's maybe bothering you. Now I promise you everything is really good. I This year has been amazing. I, I've met a lot of wonderful people that just brightens up my day and it was well worth me traveling all the way up to Yosemite to work with uh, such an amazing talent and having new lifelong friends. I must admit though, I had no idea what my expectation would be for this particular year. And maybe I thought something could have happened or was going to happen and yet you know you're you're faced with a, a definitely a, a different situation and that's that's always that's always good that's that's always good it's good for your life and I also understand that life you know can throw a major curveball to you and you don't know how to handle the situation you just gotta figure it out or go through it and and see how you land on the other side. And that's what I'm dealing with right now. I understand what the other side is of the situation I'm dealing with. So maybe me taking this solo walk will just somehow comfort me. And I like to think that way. It's always a good way to think. Because it's a, it's a positive way to think. I mean, look. There's absolutely nothing to complain about. Look what's surrounding me. Just this wonderful, you know, trees and streams and it's like eye candy. You know, it's, it's, it's amazing. Quite amazing. So, I mean, what do I have to complain about, right? Look how incredibly lucky that I am that I, I'm able to have a, a job, a career in which allows me to take this, these type of adventures around the world and, and obviously here at camp. It's, it's quite amazing. I shouldn't be complaining whatsoever. But sometimes I'm definitely going to admit that it's not... I could convince myself that I'm happy, but I don't know what that really means. And so that's the reason why I go around the world to find it. 
to study it, to see how it looks like with other people. And that's the reason why maybe I came here this year to find out what happiness is. Now last year, I was able to find that happiness for a while at least. And then it just was gone. You know, I had to go back to work and, you know, I'm trying to maintain myself there. And I am happy. I should be, right? But I don't know what it is. But yet, maybe I do. I don't know. It's just life can get really confusing sometimes. I got pure gold in front of me, right? This is all pure gold right here. And yet, you know, I'm down. But what I always do is I always try to find a way to get back where I'm supposed to be. I guess I will never find the answers to the questions I may have. And to be honest with you, I really don't want to know the answers. But, you know, one of the questions I always ask is, why am I here on this year, 2023? Why did I come back? You know, I came back, I, I, I think it's because of, I want to replicate laughter and, and happiness and, and hope. So maybe that's my reasoning for me to come back to camp just to recognize, you know, what true happiness can tr truly be and hope. So I guess what I'm trying to say is that I take comfort in knowing what my purpose in life is, is to be a teacher to all you boys and girls and you in turn reward me this camp that I come now my second summer in a row and I work here in the past but you know in this day and age and you know as old as I am you have given me the opportunity to experience this which is truly wonderful it's it's quite amazing So again, what was my expectations for 2023? I honestly had so many scenarios that was going to happen in camp, but it didn't happen. It, you know, something else, some, something amazing happened though. It was the many new friends and, uh, and bro you know, now I call them my brothers and sisters that I met this year. And of course, you know different vibe a good vibe an amazing vibe these people that I work with are awesome and you know I'm really really grateful for that truly grateful but as much grateful that I am of all my new experience I you know sometimes a lot of times I guess I just feel a little down, you know, but I know by the end of everything, I'm going to be okay because, you know, I, I am completely thankful for another day of life and it's just extremely more important than anything, you know, it's, it's, that's what I'm going to have to focus on and it's a good thing to focus on that. I don't know if the sadness has gone away, but me taking this nature walk truly helps mend the heart, I say, or 
makes everything a lot better now, you know? A lot, lot better. Now as I sit here in the open meadow, I want to take this opportunity to talk to you directly. To talk to you. I want to let you know that you are amazing. That I miss you. I'm not ashamed of saying that. But I hope you're doing well with life and whatever directions you have chosen. I just want nothing but the best for you. And that's my hopes. And that's why I took this nature walk to make sure to readjust those feelings. To readjust those feelings. So that's how I'm gonna end my video. With hope and with, you know, the ultimate goal into finding happiness which I know one day I will find it you are not given permission to be sad you're only given permission to be happy by me never forget that